all IRIX guy here, and I'm using my Mac Mini M1. I've got this 16 gig memory, one terabyte SSD. And you can see here, I've got a project still rendering in Final Cut Pro 10, and I'm also concurrently exporting by way of compressor a 4K video project. And as you'll see in my activity monitor, and you know, again, there's no tomfoolery or anything like that, man. Uh, this is just my my memory. You can see my memory utilization. I mean, I'm not getting anywhere close to 16 gigs, which is nice. And uh, then I flip over to my CPU utilization here, and you can see, I mean, this thing's handling it like a boss, man. I mean, I, it blows my mind to this day that. Uh, that Apple has released Apple Silicon and it's it's uh, grossly trumping the performance of Intel and you know Apple was just so cool about it They're like oh we're coming out with new silicone dude and you know they didn't uh, they didn't embellish it or anything and and it's just a real world Intel killer and uh, I know Intel is shaking in their boots right now but man to get this performance out of one of Apple's entry-level computers, the Mac Mini. I mean, it just blows my mind. But anyway, tell me what you think within the comments section below. Have you messed with an Apple Silicon Mac yet? And if so, what has been your experience? And again, I'm primarily a video editor, so I'm, you know, I'm uh, centering all of my my feedback around video editing and export. Hey y'all, Captain Irix Guy here. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to subscribe. It's youtube.com forward slash Irix Guy. And ring that bell icon when you do to be notified whenever I post another video. Thanks for your viewership and y'all have a good day.